Meow. Um, kind of echoing what Ellen was just saying, in planning gestures uh, to avoid irrational movement or extraneous movement, how do, how do you make that look realistic and spontaneous and rather than planned? There's something about this character, this British foppish character that's causing me to, you know, like my head's like one of those little toys where the head's just kind of doing stuff, okay. and I'd like to kind Let's of. Let's go then for what the character would do with his head, and just take all that energy and put it into the physical characterization. You mean don't shy away from it, actually? Yeah, actually do it a lot. Okay. As he does it. But even though it's for film, it wouldn't be too distracting. I don't know yet. It, it, okay. I have to see it. Okay. Whenever you're ready, go for it. I beg your pardon for interrupting you, Lady Bracknell, but this engagement is quite out of the question. Yeah, what I did notice just then is you had a lot of body movement that wasn't necessary. It's a very uh, posturing possibility with this character, mm -hmm. rather than all over the place. Let's let you plan a move away and into or up and down. So it's like a, uh, it's, it's choreographed. I beg your pardon, Lady Bracknell, for interrupting you, but this engagement is quite out of the question. That's coming along. The leaning in, yeah. you really have, all of you have to watch that because it's very seldom good. Gotcha. Yeah. If you are going to do it, though, do it so that you're still shared with the camera or with right. the audience. Keep the fit. If that's your choice. Maybe going up and down then, then we're, we're looking at you rather than this kind of thing. Right. So try up and down and see if it, what it does for his character. OK. I beg your pardon for interrupting you, Lady Bracknell, but but this engagement is quite out of the question. I am Miss Cardo's guardian, and she cannot marry without my consent until she comes of age. Okay. I still want a more specific physical characterization. Okay. It's still general. Uh, the movement isn't helping your character. I beg your pardon, Lady Bracknell. Wonderful. That is so funny. That is, <laughs> and that's character. No matter how obnoxious he is now, he's yeah. charming. Okay. Just from that little bit, going up again, just before the key word, like that's his little thing, just before he reveals something oh. that's really <laughs> terrible. Okay. Already. Um, yeah. He subsequently stayed to tea and devoured every single muffin. Let's get two of them in there. He subsequently stayed to tea and devoured every single muffin. You've got it as a tool now. I'm, now I'm saying refine it. I beg your pardon for interrupting you, Lady Bracknell, but this engagement is quite out of the question. I beg your pardon for interrupting you, Lady Bracknell, but this engagement is quite out of the question. Yes. How'd that feel? Good. As part of the character. The, the gesture? The last one. Yeah, it felt, it felt better for some reason. It worked. 